Please take your seats quickly, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Hi guys, welcome to One Minute Tennis Coach. Today I'm gonna to talk to you about the one-handed backhand. And I wanna to talk to you about how to hit the ball harder and more aggressively. This might be for the situation of a passing shot, or it might be uh, in a baseline rally where there's a space and you wanna accelerate the ball into that space. But this is how to energize your stroke and really add speed without losing consistency or accuracy. Now, if we're talking about accelerating and being aggressive with the backhand, then I'm gonna assume that you've already got a fundamentally sound backhand. In earlier videos, we've talked about dropping the left hand below the right hand, and also about drawing the shoulder blades together. But to really energize the stroke, I suggest that you really concentrate on the left hand. And how this works is very simple. When we talk, when we use our hands, then the two hands move together. What we want to do is we want to strengthen the right arm without stressing the right arm. And to do that, we want to put the stress into the left side and the right side will simply mirror it, but it won't have the stress, it will just have the strength. So here's how it works. When you play your backhand, if I'm gonna hit the backhand directly at the camera here, then what I do is I go through the stroke, make the footwork movement, and then as I make the stroke, I make sure that my left arm is pointing exactly away, directly and precisely away from where I want the ball to go. So if the ball's coming to you in the camera, then you can see my left arm is away from the camera. If I want to send the ball directly to the right here, then I make the stroke and drive, and my left arm is directly pointed away from where I want to direct the ball. And maybe an easier way of showing you this is if I want to hit the ball directly away from the camera and from you, then I make the stroke and now I point my arm directly at you. I have stress and tension in the arm, just the same as the slice backhand, and my backhand will have more energy, more power, more precision, but it will not lose consistency. I hope this makes sense. Try it now, let us know how it works in your one-handed backhand. It's particularly effective on a passing shot um, when, when you want to direct the ball precisely past a net player. Hope you enjoyed today's session and don't forget to like, share and subscribe please. It makes a big difference to us. And remember, if you need more help with your game, we have an online consultation. The link to the website's below. Thanks for watching and see you next time for more unique tennis lessons that really work.